Well, now for something completely different. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, I give you the Atwood Steamcraft Amazon Queen Side Wheeler. A truly remarkably ridiculous concept for a, <laughs> for a toy. This is a steam powered plastic boat. <laughs> yeah, I know, amazing, isn't it? Um, I, 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 I just find this whole thing is just quite incredible. Um, apparently, uh, these were made in the 1950s, I believe, and um, uh, Atwood Steamcraft made uh, three that I know of. Um, this one, the Amazon Queen, which is a paddle paddle steamer, obviously. Um, they made the Jungle Boat, which was again had the same boiler and motor in it, but had a conventional propeller. And they also made the Congo Launch, which was again um, same boiler and motor, but conventional propeller rather than the paddles. But um, I just, I, I just, this whole concept of this thing is just quite incredible. I, I just, I, I mean, how many of these got fire and melted and then sank? <laughs> quite a lot of them, I would imagine. So, um, but uh, anyway, uh, it had a, it, it's complete. Um, I'll put the box up in a minute because it came with, with its box and it even came with a little instruction uh, manual, which we, which we have here. And let's open it up, which I'm very pleased about. Because normally this is the sort of thing that gets lost. So I think this is probably put away in a in an attic or loft or a garage somewhere for many many years. So yeah, it's it's a, an amazing bit of kit. It's got a few issues. Um, I've had a fiddle around with it since I got it, and um, the uh, I've got the motor. The motor runs fine now on compressed air. I can get that to run, but the boiler has a leak, so I've got to take that apart. And of course, the end end plates are riveted on, so I need to strip that down and find out where where the boilers. Um, leaking from um i i have a feeling the boiler is tin plate although it looks like it's brass i think that's just a gold paint and it's coming off so it's probably rusted but um yeah i mean hopefully ultimately assuming there's no leaks in the hull um it would be really nice to actually see if we could sail this at some point so um let me just throw the box up so you can have a look at that so there's the box um it's a bit tatty, but considering its age, yes. Atwood Steamcraft, Amazon Sidewheeler. Real life steam action. Ready to run, steam powered model boat, complete with fuel. It actually takes the, the dry tablet type um, uh, fuel. Let's uh, come back a bit. So. But. Uh, yeah, it's, uh, it, it's quite an impressive bit of kit. Um, Yeah, unfortunately, as I said, I, I've, I've got a few issues with the boiler, but we'll hopefully get those sorted out. Um, and then um, we'll definitely steam it on some supports to start with, and then hopefully we can actually get, get this thing in the water. Well, the boiler's been repaired. We've got heat, one fuel tablet in there, and it, it certainly sounds like it's uh, boiling the water, so fingers crossed, let's hope we can get the engine running without setting fire to the boat. Well, I think we're about there. Yes, amazing, it's running. And we've got stuff coming out of the chimney as well. Look at that. I am impressed. Well, it works, so and it makes a hell of a racket too. <laughs> nice to see the steam coming out of the chimney. That is well cool. <laughs> I mean that's all that's all the flame is
Unbelievable. Okay, well, I think we can certainly call the first test steaming a, uh, a success. But it's probably hitting somewhere, I think. Not sure where, but... Uh, yeah, well, it definitely works, isn't it? We need to put it into water now, see whether it actually will actually sail. <laughs> All right, anyway, there you go. That's the Atwood Steamcraft Amazon Queen paddle steamer under steam for the first time. And we managed to successfully do it without setting fire to it, which is excellent. Well, <clears throat> I think we're about done uh, so far with the um, Atwood Steamcraft side wheeler, the Amazon Queen. Um, uh, it runs fine. Um, I've made, I've done a couple of small mods. I've added some, um, I printed out some little black square decals for the windows. I think it makes it look a little bit better than just having the windows red. And um, on the back here, the rudder doesn't tend to stay where you put it. So I've added this little sprung brass bar, which means that the rudder now actually stays wherever you, you put it. Um, so um, yeah, um, basically, um, really need to find somewhere to sail it and, and I'm scrunching my head a bit I, I'm, I'm not sure of anywhere sort of suitable really in in in, in the Salisbury area uh, hopefully I'll find somewhere um because I really would like to to um you know steam this um sail it on water under its own steam power you know um I've checked it uh in the bath and it definitely doesn't leak the hull is intact so that's good that's good good you know um, but yeah, it would just be nice to sail it. So, but anyway, that's about it for, for now. I hope you enjoyed the video on the um, Atwood Steamcraft Sidewheeler, the Amazon Queen. Thanks very much for watching. Cheers.